welcome back to my channel I'm making this video for my friend Ken shout out to Ken so this is a basic uh, demonstration on the, how to uh, to show GPS coordinates on your open TX radios so right now I'm using the upper sky X9 light well, you can use this on any open TX radios like the TBS Tango 2 uh, Radio Master TX16 TX12 and even the jumper T light so to proceed um, basically on the screen of your open TX radio just uh, assign this as a GPS demo the model name so if uh, as you well know your present page so prolonged press you will be prompted to the telemetry screens on your open TX radio so right now we haven't uh, on this uh, demonstration on this model we haven't uh, put in any telemetry screens for you to understand how to go about uh, GPS coordinates on your open TX radio so we'll press exit so and then we press menu if you press menu you get a list of all your models here so I added the GPS demo model so if you that's uh, on page 1 of 12 if you press on page you go forward and this is the uh, page 2 setup where you rename the model and the rest and uh, will not concentrate on that so on this uh, on this radio unlike the radio master tx16 and tx12 there is a dedicated back button so for you to have to go back to the page you have to prolong press the page button so it goes back to page one and then prolong press again and this is the uh, display screen that we need to set up so right now we haven't put in any um, display there that's why there was no telemetry screens noted when we prolonged uh, press the page button now from here if you press on the scroll button so it highlights your choices on uh, what kind of uh, telemetry screens you would want so the first choice is nums that means numbers then bars you can choose anything and it create a bar so from 0 to 100 so if it is a battery it's 50% battery and uh, creates a bar then a script so you can put in a script here like a beta flight script or a inav script not quite sure if this uh, works pretty well on the inav script this uh, kind of radio but the uh, more recent one the radio masters the x16s and uh, the jumper t18 can run pretty well the inav scripts and i think that's the last option so what we want to do now is uh, just the number so you go to the number so number now you want to get the screen information of your gps so you select from this for example you would want to get the gps satellites okay so you have to choose gps satellites so this one gps speed heading altitude and sats 
okay there now we pause here we try to exit then we go to the main screen if you prolong press now you are prompted to go to your telemetry screens now we have a sats there so unfortunately my demo uh, flight controller right now is inside the house so i don't have any satellites uh, so let's say for example if you would want to so if you go back now to menu then prolong press the page then if you want to get the prolong you press that's the if you want to get that uh, option if you want to that on the blank space press on that one and then let's say you would want to get your gps speed so if you notice there's a lot of options here so you're not limited to just the gps uh, information you would want to want to get your for example your battery status so or x watt okay then your this one the your transmit power how much power are you transmitting from your radio to the receiver now you would want to do the definitely your gps longitude and your latitude oh. no that is gps there that's it that's a gps longitude and latitude now you have to make sure that this information is available for you to choose on your telemetry screens and the way for you to do it is you go back here in your sensors to so your telemetry page it's page 11 make sure that your radio is able to get those information from your telemetry screen from sensors so if you don't get any of those you discover the new sensors and um, once you discover the new sensors then it will be available on this display screens if it is not discovered by your radio it is not possible for you to choose it as and information in your telemetry screen. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.